Hello everyone, I want to thank you for um, and welcome you to my YouTube channel here. Um, this is actually a promotional channel video just so people know what I'm doing here is I'm basically going to promote and show people the videos I have and kind of put that up in an advertisement. So I'm going to show some of the video content that I have currently on this channel. Some of this may just be repetitive so kind of bear with me on this. This is um, my channel right here first of all and it's actually got videos all the way down here I've, I've got actually about I don't know, like close to 200 videos or 180 or something like that and the videos you're going to find in this channel to kind of get on the track with this I have a back in 2009 I set up a lot of Grand Theft Auto videos when I started actually hacking into the game and learned how to create my own mods if you would for the game and I also have tutorials for Grand Theft Auto this is 4 by the way not 5 and then we we'll kind of skip ahead here um, later after the Grand Theft Auto fad kind of started wearing out, I got into Dark GDK, which is C++, created by the game creators, and I started using their SDK, and I created a lot of videos on there, and I actually have an um, RPG game, I created a full 3D game, which is actually right here, and I got back into some more modding, of course, and then later, some of the bigger stuff I got into was Atari Computer, this is Atari Basic Programming and Machine Language Programming or Semi Language Programming for the 8-bit computer. So there's a lot of tutorial videos on that. And then there's also some videos here for uh, Atari Basic um, games that I was showing here. There was, uh, I got in later some Commodore 64 games. I kind of uploaded some demos for that. And also for the, um, the web developer types, there's some here for ASP.NET. You'll find a few videos on that master pages you can see web pages here um, there's more dark GDK there uh, some more Grand Theft Auto you can kind of see I was kind of like in a, in a spiral there for a while until eventually the dark GD or sorry the Grand Theft Auto 4 hacking thing kind of wore off then I got more heavily into the Atari computer so here's a lot of the Atari basic uh, semi language videos you're gonna find on here there's tons of them on here by the way um, then I got back into Dark GDK here, showing some of the examples. Some people were asking me how to edit them. Um, there was actually a maze developed in Dark G GDK, so that came with um, the Dark GDK downloads. So I showed people how to do that. And obviously, this was one of the bigger games I designed. It's a 3D game, no name. I just um, was coming up with some ideas there. Then I got into some Atari Commodore 64 reviews, Atari reviews. Showed some of my own basic programs. And much later I got into the Wind Vice for the C64 and showed some of the programs I had put and transferred over there and typed in. And I got into a Commodore 64 hacking, showed some of the hacking videos I have on here. I think there's probably only one. And then um, a little bit on the Amiga 500, kind of hooking it up to a larger television screen. And then later I got heavily into the Commodore 64, so I really showed, started showing people videos and programs I had developed in Commodore 64 Basic and it was one here in assembly language and after a while I went to work in software industry and I started working in mobile design so I started doing a few here for mobile design and you see some Atari here again and the most recent stuff I've done outside of this is actually a QBasic kind of showing an old QBasic game I had created back in the days so I wanted you guys kind of to get a feel for it and see that's what this channel is all about currently um, mostly you're going to find tutorial type videos to teach you programming, web development, and just anything in that line. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this video short because it's a promotional video. Well, thanks for watching guys. And subscribe to my channel if you like this information and if you're interested in any of the things I've talked about. Thank you.